And number 45 on your card, white side Taurus, is carrying number clock 44. So 45 on your card, white side Taurus, is carrying number clock 44. How many in the front going, Rick? Uh, it'll be four. So it'll be two rows of four off the gate. Out off go, Mark. So on the inside the second line, number 40 here is kickstart, Andrew Hardwick. Four out off go, Andrew, so on the outside the front line. Number 44 there is Wi-Fi Taurus, Derek Pritchard. A full position there on the inside off go, Number 39 there, that's Ivan Cracker, Mark White. Um, three no out Wayne, off okay. Go. Three out off go, Mark White. Number 39 there, three out off go, Mark White. So three out on the second line. Shane Egerton at the controls of 48, that's Holmes Dreamer. 20 yards on your own, Shane, okay? There's Holmes Dreamer off 20 yards on your own. So get your money on for this, the break B. It's one straight race. Racing for the Dean Jones Perpetual Trophy. Kindly sponsored by Tom Jones. So here's Mark White on Ivan Cracker. Got a bit of form behind him, this Ivan Cracker. Mark Ivan Cracker. Mark Ivan Cracker. So you're on the outside of the second line. That's where they're going. Come from the MSA table to the Carlin. So that's your runners for the grade B. Get your money on. Make your way back to the start. Wide side Taurus. Two out on the gate, Maple Star. Three out on the gate, Ivan Cracker. On the wide outside of the front line, four out on the gate is kickstart. Tucking in on the second line, drawn five off the gate, two hot today. Drawn six, Von Hasty. Drawn seven, Rywins Ducklin. And on the outside of the second line, drawn eight, clear zone. And trailing 20 yards on his own, Holmes Dreamer. So watch your trail. Lining up. Running in. Looking good. Over the dip. White flags up. Your money's on. Go! And away they go for the great B. And what breaks out of the brigade? On the inside there, we can see Maple Star. It's Maple Star who takes them along for the truck against the wheel. There's Maple Star on the outside. Chuck behind them. There were two more today. On the outside there, two more today. We can see Kickstart. Then we've got Bon Hasty. Just behind Bon Hasty is Home Streamer. On the outside of Home Streamer there, Brywin's Ducklin. And the back marker at this stage is Claire's own. Well bunched to go down that back straight for the first time. 
one mile 140 yards to trot so it's out there in front there it's maple star got the call out in front by two coming against those rails there is Derek Pritchard with wide side Taurus going on the wide outside we can see Brywin's duckling also going nicely on the outside there we can see kickstart they're still well bunched two off today as well up there also Von Hasty one that's trying to make up ground on the wide outside is kickstart ladies and gentlemen so off the turn and up the stretch as they head towards the bell this time it's out there in front, Maple Star got the call from on the outside of him, is Kickstart, tucking against those rails there. We can see, tucking against those rails is Wide Side Taurus, who went back to go by. Wide Side Taurus, also making a crack on the on the outside, is Wide Side Duckling, but they're still well bunched around that turn for the final time. It's still in right there in front of Maple Star, got the call by two from Kickstart, going nicely on the outside, Wide Side Duckling, in against those rails, I think Cracker, there goes two off today with a run on the back straight. He's going to have a cut him if he can. Holden Dream has been let loose down that back straight, but as he left too, too late, also the one that's made a bad mistake is Ivan Cracker. That shot in chance he may have had. So down that back straight, it's still Maple Star, but Brywin's duckling got a tremendous pony on the outside. And it's Brywin's duckling now. Comes trying to take it up from Maple Star on the inside. Tucking against those rails is kickstart. Two what today is on the wide outside. Also trying to make up ground is Holmes Dreamer. Clear zone. Bon, bon Hasty is trying to make up ground on the right side. Off the turn and up the stretch they come. And it's still out there. It's out there in front now. Making up ground on the outside. So right there in front, it's out in front, it's two today, it's Brywin Stockley, two up today, making a friend. But it's Brywin Stockley, it's Brywin Stockley, making a friend on the outside. Brywin Stockley, it's Brywin Stockley, 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 then I think it was Clare Zone, then we had Holmes Dreamer, then Ivan Cracker and Whiteside Taurus. That's only the way I saw them pass the post, wait for the official verdict. On Hasty going a tremendous pony on the outside. So Tom Jones to present the trophy, please. So Tom Jones to present the trophy. So judges placing subject to the all clear. First 35, second 33. Third, number 40. So first 35, that's Brywin Stucklin from the Getting Stables, Gilwern, driven by Wayne Knox. Second 33, that's Bon Hasty from the Collingwood Stables, Huntington, driven by Pops Parker. And officially placed third, number 40, Kickstart. In a winning time of 218.97. 218.97, well, the winning time. The winner, 35, that's Brywin Stucklin. So if uh, Mr. Tom Knox driving. Yes, thank you very much. First time owners, I believe. So a cracking pony for the first time. Is that right, Wayne? Yeah. First time owners. Yeah. So there we are, ladies and gentlemen. Big round of applause for the Gethin Stables of Gilwern, winning the Grade B here at Knighton. It his granddad brought her at the end of last season and then he died in January. What do you want? So, and he, he, like she's won three now, but he always wanted to win first time with her. So, um, Luke, who's the owner of this now, was his grandfather who brought this horse at the end of last season. I think he had a back in eye for buying this one. Unfortunately, he died back in January, so didn't get to see the horse win, but there we are. So, uh, 